some advice on what moms really want for their special day. Beauty and life coach Kim Gravel is joining me here. She is beautiful. Hey, thank that's, you. That's the beauty part. And I'll beauty. receive that. All right. Okay. So, Kim, let's get started. Let's talk about first what to scratch off the list that mom does not Rochelle, want. Tell us. Tell let us. it go. Let all the typicals go. Okay. Okay, let all the flowers, the candy, because like God that? knows we don't need more candy. <laughs> you know, That's true. if you're a mom, you do not need candy. Just and put the, the box down. flowers don't last either. They don't last. It's a nice gesture. It's typical. Yeah? Okay. It's typical. For me, mm -hmm. I just know for all my friends and for myself, it's time. Time. T-I-M-E. Time. Okay, okay, okay. So how, how can we be creative? How does mom know that you really, really, really care and you really thought about this? Well, th this is the thing about it. You know, I think once you become a mother mm -hmm. or once you become, you know, a wife and a mother or, you know, the single mom out there, mm -hmm. ask, your, ask your mom, remember that she's a person. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> a lot of times, you know, I, I hear someone say, hey, mom, 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 mom. Remember she, I was, I'm Kim first. You know, I'm, I'm a person. And she was a person before you came right. along. I mean, we have our hopes, we have our dreams, we have all that. So find out what she likes that's outside of the typical mom stuff. With well, time. I'm going to say it again, time. Well, okay, but well, this is what happens to me all the time. I'll say, mom, what do you want? Okay. And she always says, well, I don't need anything. I don't want anything. What yeah, she's she lying. Oh, yeah. she's <laughs> lying. <laughs> I, think we, I think we don't need anything for sure, but I think uh, we want to know that we're, that you care, okay. that you you know a, a nice letter or whatever. But for 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 people who have young children, mm -hmm. time and I think for the for the older mom like my mom and your mom, mm -hmm. I think just to show you care, maybe go to church with her on Sunday. Oh, do you see what I'm saying? Maybe, I do. Maybe step out of the box a little bit and do things that you wouldn't normally do for her on a daily basis. Okay, so big. So those are ways to be creative yeah. and to be thoughtful. That's what I'm going to do with my mom. I'm going to go to church with her Sunday, and she's going to be in the choir singing, and I'm going to wave, and I'm just going to, you know, spend that time with her the way she wants me to spend it. Does I that like that. So yeah. So because uh, the note that I have here that says, um, "How do you incorporate um, celebrating yeah. um, celebrating that day and honoring the family?" Yeah. That's what you do. It is absolutely about time. It's about time, and, and this is important too. Moms never stop. We were just back there talking. Moms never stop. Our minds are, I'm right here thinking right now, what is Bo and Blanton doing right now? Because <laughs> our minds never stop. So when you give us some time or carve out some time that's just about us as a person, you see what I'm saying? Not as a mom, I do. not as a wife, as a person. What are your, you know, when you carve that time out for mom, I think, I think you'll get the most bang for your buck because that's free. So a vacuum cleaner is off the list. That'll get, oh, you, that'll get you hurt. Yes, honey. Now you can always do diamonds. <laughs> like my husband does CZs because he's cheap. <laughs> Kim, you're great. I love it. Thank and you. happy Mother's Day. You too, babe. All right.